What's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. This is Camping Teddy and today I'm playing Fly or Die .io. This is part three in my Angel of Death series. So if you haven't seen the first two, please look down in the description and click on the first two and watch those and then come back and watch this one. Alright, now I am the green pterodactyl now, so the object is going to be to try and get out of this phase and do the next one as quick as possible. I'm going to eat all these cats, all the meat I can find, maybe do a little bit of PvP in, and try and get out of this formation fast. This formation is a great formation for PvP, but the bad thing about it is you're so big it's also easy to hit you. So if you run across any of them nasty little reaper guys, yeah, you can pretty much kiss your butt goodbye unless you get to a cloud real fast, because yeah, they will totally destroy you. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm going to sit back, I'm going to try and get a few of these cats, grab some more meat, get my experience bar up a little bit, and try and get out of this farm and into the next one. I believe the next farm after this, if I'm not mistaken, is the green slime guy. Toxic Adventure guy. <laughs> and he's pretty fun, you know. He's not really powerful, but he does have a poison attack, and if you know how to use him, he's pretty good. You can stay over the water and keep on, you know, making people have to keep running to the water. As long as they have to keep on going to the water, you can keep on attacking them as they're coming out of the water. If you time it just right, you can usually end up killing them fairly, fairly quickly. You know, like I said, I don't always, you know, chase after players for a real long time, you know. If I see an opportunity to kill somebody, I'll try and take it. You know, if I know they'll get away or they have a good percent chance of getting away, I won't even waste my time chasing them, you know what I mean? To me, it's like, if you have a will to survive or a will to live, I'll let you live in most situations. If you have just no will to live and you just come right by me thinking I'm not going to kill you, yeah, I'm, I'm just going to eat you because I need that experience. <laughs> Definitely need the experience. You get a lot more experience from PvPing than you do from going around in the meat and you know the other stuff from you know just the game itself. So yeah, PvPing does get you a lot of experience a lot faster. The bigger the thing is that you eat, the more experience you get. Why, when you get up to the green pterodactyl, you really gotta watch your P's and Q's and make sure there's nobody sneaking up on you. You know, I never underestimate anybody, you know what I mean? Like, I might talk some smack here and there, but still, even though I talk smack, I don't underestimate people, like, because tables can turn very quickly before you even expect it. You always gotta be aware of your surroundings and who's after you. You know, sometimes you might think, you know, you're only fighting against one person and he's got a buddy he's playing with that sneaks up on you and it'll hit you purposely, try and get in your way to block you to slow you down so he can come up and hit you. Yeah, so you really gotta watch out for them too, for the double teamers and stuff like that. <laughs> you know, I try to play solo, I don't like double teaming, you know what I mean? I just, I, I like to play by myself, you know what I mean? No rules, just straight out go on a server and bang out whoever I can and get a big score as I can. Or until I get bored. You, know, you do get bored of the game after a while, you know, you just kill stuff for so long and it's just like it ain't even fun no more. It's just like, uh, you know, I gotta take a break. I mean, it's still fun, you know, next time you play, you know, it's loads of fun again. Right, this is a game that, like, it really does it never truly gets old, you know, you might get tired of playing it after, like, six hours of playing it, but, you know, that happens with any game, then after you take a little break for a little bit, you come right back, and it's like, bam, right back into the action. It is a really cool little game, so yeah, if you guys haven't played it, man, check it out, it's flyerdie.io. Flyer you know, it's a browser game, it's free to play, go in there, check it out. And have fun, you know what I mean? It doesn't take long to get used to the game and get accustomed to it. Grab all this meat real quick. And I should be at enough to level up. We're pretty close to it. You know, with some of the green ooze guys, I'm going to start doing a little bit of the PvP. And like right now, I'm getting to a point to where I can almost start really getting into the PvP. And that's where the big majority of the experience is going to come from. You know, I gotta get, uh, what is it? I 
get the little green poopy guy. Uh, my toxic adventure. I also got the stone guy too, which I just forgot about. Has some stones. I'm just thinking about that. So yeah, I'm not sure which one this is. I believe this is the green guy, but it could be the stone guy too. I'm not sure. Find out here in a minute once I uh, get this next piece of meat. That's pretty cool right here. Now you can't poison anything like the wasps or whatnot because the wasps obviously they're a poison type animal. So yeah, you really can't do anything to them. But pretty much anybody else I touch, you know, besides like the reapers and the ghosts and stuff, I could pretty much destroy on this guy. The only thing is his attacks aren't very strong, you know, his attacks are very, very weak. But, you know, it's, it's a long-term effect of poison. Until the person gets to water, you know, the poison will keep on damaging it. So even though it's not a strong attack, it's still a good attack. And if you can keep somebody out of the water, you know what I mean? You're good at knocking them out of the water and keeping them from landing in the water, then you can really kill people pretty easily. Uh, I'm still learning how to do that really, really good, you know what I mean? I'm getting better at it. Once I get that down pack, yeah, it'll totally, totally be on. Like, yeah, I'm trying to block him right now. <laughs> Let's see, you know, get over here. Ah, got him. <laughs> see, yeah, like him, he's done. <laughs> like we can do. <laughs> see, that was a good chunk of experience, too. You see how much my experience went up from that one guy? That's why I say try and PvP as early as you can. Now, PvP is so important. That's where you get most of your good experience from. Just make sure you're always minding your P's and Q's, man. Always watch what's going on around you because people will try and sneak up on you. I mean, they will sneak up very fast. See, I don't try and stay in that diamond area, into the, the pyramid or whatever. Because it's very, very dangerous going in there when you're this guy. Because, you know, if a bigger guy comes in there, like one of those little, uh... The ghost guys, whatever with the sickles, you know, it's pretty much a wrap. They're gonna try to trap you in there and they try and take you out. You know, which you can trap people in there like you see me do a little bit ago, but you know, it's not worth the risk of me dying to go get one person in there. You know, I know I can take out a lot more in you know, the open area. If I can get him, get him. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> no. That's what I mean. You juggle him. <laughs> See, I just juggled him right there. Wouldn't let him in the water. Oh, look at him. Oh, he's trying to get me. <laughs> uh, See, that's epic. That's what I mean. Try and juggle people. That's what I try and do. <laughs> So evil. I told you guys, man, look at how much your experience boosts too when you kill these guys. Like, you guys just gave me huge chunks of experience. Like, I'm gonna come get him. <laughs> oh, I'm so evil. So evil. You're done, buddy. <laughs> Watch my experience pop up again. Boom. Nice, another big chunk. That's right, I'll take him where I can get him, man. These are nice chunks coming up. Can I get another one? Can I get another one? <laughs> like I said, man, that's what I do. I hardcore PvP. I love killing people. There's nothing funner than killing people in the morning. <laughs> uh, look at this guy, he's running. Uh, get that. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go right now. <laughs> Buddy, yeah, buddy, <laughs> I got another one. <laughs> You're just another victim, kid. Ah, oh, he got away. No, he's getting away. Ah, uh, I'm gonna let him go. I think. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wait, nope. No, I'm almost 
Thomas Adam. He hit that wall, man. He don't want to live that much. Come on, buddy. Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> it's all right. He got away. He wanted to live fair and square. He got away. You can get this bat, though. That'd be a nice chunk of experience. Come on, bat. Give me that experience. Oh, 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 come here. No, no. Oh, let him go. Come get the turkey. The turkey's good. Come on, turkey. Ah, no, gobble, gobble, got away. <laughs> ah, sometimes I get left empty handed, but I'm not totally empty handed. Because, hey, Mark, tell them what we got. Today we got a consolation prize. Oh, hello, Moto. Alright, let's see if I can take both these guys out. Oh, no, what is this? Oh. Oh, look at him trying to get me. Oh, sneaky. That's what I say. You always gotta mind your P's and Q's. Oh, they're working together. No wonder. Look at them. Ha ha ha. They're working together. You guys are scrubs. Ha ha ha. You're trying to get me. Uh uh, buddy. I ain't dumb. You know, come on. Two verse one. You're both higher monsters than me. Let's see if I can get this guy right here. <laughs> He's poisoned. That's a good sign. I'm trying to take him out. No, his buddy's gone. What up, buddy? <laughs> yeah, that was slick, though. You see that? How quickly somebody can just come in there and ruin your whole day? Like, he was seriously trying to ruin my day there. Oh, there he comes back. <laughs> oh, look, now he wants to come out. Look, now his buddy's back. Oh, poison him again. Poison him again. Oh, I'm going to get you, buddy. That's all right. I'm gonna get you, little friend. I'll probably get you too. Just wait till I get a little bit bigger. <laughs> you gonna try and get me? Oh, you're so sad. You're so sad, bro. <laughs> oh, he's close. He's close. Look at him. Oh, I can almost taste the sickle. Ah. <laughs> I'm in the cloud, bro. Get at me, son. <laughs> Ah, oh, it's too much. <laughs> too much. <laughs> yeah, right. You think I'm just gonna pop out and let you kill me, bro? I ain't that dumb. Come on now. Uh, <laughs> oh, man. That's horrible. You didn't even follow me out. Ah. Uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna go in there with that guy that close. I thought about it, but yeah, I don't think I wanna do that. Follow this guy. See if this guy, if I can kill this guy, it'll give me exactly what I need. I'll have enough to, uh, to boost down to my next level. So, we'll know in a second. Hopefully, he can. Ah, see, he couldn't find water. I got it. <laughs> I tell you, I love this game so much. game is like so awesome. Probably the best game I've played so far in a long, long time. Definitely one of the better games. Tracks real quick. And, uh, so this guy, he's, he, these ones are easy right here. They kind of give you these levels. You know, you just come down here, grab these. I mean, these levels are fairly fast right here. So, you no, know, this ain't really gonna make it or break it right here. Not at all. Thank you. 
Yeah, again, the game is called FireDie.io. If you guys haven't played it yet, type it in your browser and come on in and check it out. It's a very cool game, and also, I'd urge you to create an account as well. You play it without creating an account, but when you create an account with it, you get levels, and every level you get is 10% more experience you get, you know, per kill. So, if you get to level 10, you're getting 100% more experience than you know, what you would have got before. So yeah, it's definitely worth it to log in, create an account, and to play it that way because, yeah, you know, it just makes it so much better. Now let's go right here, finish up grabbing these. See, that's the whole thing too, you know, I also, like I said earlier, I don't stay stagnant, you know what I mean? I keep moving, and I pop through levels very fast. Eggs. Yeah, I don't like to try and stay, you know, in one place too long. You know, we're on one, uh, one transformation too long. Uh, get in, get it done, get her done, and get the heck on. <laughs> yeah, this is definitely, definitely, definitely a cool game. Definitely one of the better games. No doubt about that in my mind. You really gotta be on your P's and Q's when you're down here too. You know, it's really easy for somebody to slip down here and come try and kill you under here. You really gotta watch out and pay attention to what's going on. You, know, you can never be slacking in this game. Like really, you gotta pay attention. Like if you're slacking, you know you're gonna get caught. You know what I mean? That's gonna be your own fault. You, know, you always gotta be paying attention to what's around you. See, I skipped all those other eggs and came right to that one because I knew the next egg I ate, you know, would go dark again on me. So that's why I did that. Pop right up. Now I'm a little devil guy with the pitchfork. <laughs> So now this guy isn't bad for PvPing, you know, he's still not one of my favorites, to me he's pretty weak too, but his fire does do a nice little considerable amount of damage pretty quick, so, I mean that is definitely a good part of since he sets people on fire, but he doesn't set people on fire every time you hit him, you know, it takes two or three hits sometimes to, before he sets somebody on fire, you know, but he's definitely not a bad you know character to get some pvping in with he's just not one of my favorites to uh, you know do a lot of damage you know, this guy's just gonna see and let me burn him in the water <laughs> whatever bro you let me do it i'm gonna do it <laughs> oh man that's what i mean though look at this like always pvp when you can oh yeah there we go oh Catch him under here. Haha, <laughs> can I get two for one? Can I get two for one? Watch my experience bar. Just so I'll get up. But yeah, it ain't bad. I got a nice little chunk off of him. Let's see if I can get them both. I have a nice little chunk. It's a free experience. <laughs> now we get away. <laughs> this guy right here will give me more experience than he would, but I mean, no, forget about it. Forget about it. <laughs> All right. Oh, the spider too. That's where you see me coming down here. I watched this big chunk of experience I get off the spider. This is ridiculous. And this is why I do the spider hunting with this guy too. Because this guy isn't one of my favorites, so I like to transform from him as soon as possible. So that's what I do right here. I come down, I wreck the spider real quick. Take my slap happy butt around here. Get back up out of here. Yeah, you see my experience just pop up. That huge chunk of experience I got. That is from killing the spider. That is definitely, definitely worth it. So I'm going to maintain right over here. Give the spider a little bit of time to... You know, come back and then in a few minutes I'll come check back up on it and try and kill it again. You know, rinse and repeat, rinse and repeat. That's the best way. 
get experience really fast with this guy. Listen, I am a really good player when it comes to this game, you know, like, I do I kill a lot of people, and like, wait, wait, wait until I get my, uh, to the devil's spin, you know, to do that with the sickle if I get that far. Like, I really hope I get that far, because if I do, like, I'm totally going to destroy the server. <laughs> like, there's no doubt about it. Like, I'm pretty evil, like, don't ever underestimate me. Oh, man, this guy's going to be kicked. <laughs> Oh, you're so hit. Oh, you're done. Rest in peace, fella. Rest in peace. <laughs> Alright, now I'll come check back on the spiders. See if the spiders respond. Hopefully he has. It's been a couple minutes. Yeah, it would be very nice if he respond. I'll be able to get another huge chunk of experience from him. And hopefully nobody else comes down in here trying to kill me, <laughs> like the little ghost guy. So, really gotta watch out for him. Yeah, those guys are sneaky. But I'm the same way, like when I get that high, like I'm bad. Uh, water don't boil when you're staring at it. Something like that. Something to that effect. Alright, so now let's see if the spider's back. Come on, spider, you can do it. You can do it. There you are. Alright, cool. And here we go. Spider's lit on fire. That works. That works for me. Alright, <clears throat> now that I got that taken care of, oh you see a big chunk of experience I got, oh look at him, alright, well I'm going to be logging off here in a second, we're not logging off, but stopping this video, and I'm going to be resuming for the next video for part 4 here in a minute, look at this guy following me, <laughs> you want to follow me buddy, you ain't going to get me, I promise you, you're too good, <laughs> you can try, you can wish, it's helpful thank you. You're gonna need to double team me and triple team me to get me. Okay, you go. Leave me, I know how to get away. Yeah, I see him too, he's up there. I'm gonna come over here real quick and I'm gonna try and see if I can see him. And if he ain't coming to me, he'll throw me, so I'm gonna go around this way. <laughs> see, he's my noggin. You always gotta watch out for them guys, because they are sneaky. He's going to be messing around trying to get in there looking for me, I guarantee it, not knowing I came all the way up around here and flanked around the side of it. Anyways, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. Peace!